Abigail. In this moment, I am catching but a glimmer of what Jesus meant when he said he is coming for his bride. Before anything else, I want to make the vow that I will love you like God loves us. My Abigail, my bride, my best friend, my love. I promise that I will love you with all of my heart and all of my soul and all of my body. I will willingly lay my life down for you in every area of my life. I will give you my hope, my strength, my delight, my affection. I promise that I am yours and that I'm not going anywhere, but we are going somewhere. To my best friend and the love of my life, I vow to let you fully see me, to take me in and not hide away from you when things get hard or there is pain in this life. I will celebrate you in this beautiful life always letting you know that I am the woman in this world who is choosing to give to you daily. Your birthday will always be my favorite holiday. I commit to stewarding my beauty. I will allow myself to be beautiful before you, giving you permission to see me and take me in. I will be a resting place for you when this world feels out of control and lonely. We will always let love lead us back to each other. I'm choosing you in a new way today, and I will fight for this choice every day until death divides us or God brings us to heaven. I'm choosing to pursue you all of my days, and the good times and the hard ones, and through gain and through loss, through sickness and health, through times of harvest and times of hardship. No matter what we face, I will provide for you. I will protect you, and I will admit over and over again that I need you and I need help. I'm giving you my body through the grace of God. I'm giving you my clean hands and a pure heart. As we become one, my body is yours and yours alone. I promise to see you, to listen to you, to hold you, and to trust you. I'm choosing to let you see me, to hear my thoughts, and to hold on to me. I will listen to your heart, Gabe, and value its needs. I will splash you with joy when things get serious and we need to have fun. I will sit with you in sadness and not be scared to shed tears with you. I will be patient with your heart, not scurrying past what you feel, but sitting with you in it. I want to care for you and tend to you, Kate, setting a table of love before you. I commit to pausing and remembering the gift of our covenant, which is that I am never alone. You will never be a burden to me, nor will our family. You will be the crown on my head and my greatest pride and joy. I am vowing to always be yours. My heart belongs to no one else. I am trusting you to carry it and steward it. I promise that I will always walk humbly with the Lord as I lead our family. I will be the priest of our home and will pray often and ask more questions than give answers, and sit in the beauty and tension life will inevitably bring, and we will seek the Lord. We will work through everything together, coming out stronger again and again. I promise that God will always lead me as I lead you. Abigail, I love you. I couldn't have ever guessed that God would give me a bride who is as beautiful, kind, and radiant as you. I commit to not performing for you to receive your affirmation. I vow to not be superwoman. Instead, I vow to be Abigail with you. I will embrace your weaknesses and I will never shame you for them. I vow to be vulnerable with you and share my honest thoughts, not holding on tight to control, but opening my hands to your feedback. And I commit to letting you and Jesus heal me to let God into the brokenness of my story and yours to create something beautiful. We will be a family who has been redeemed by God. You are my bright light. You move my heart. You are my greatest gift. And I will choose to remember that you are the proof that God is real and he really does love me. 
I vow to let God be one with us. I will not lean into what I think is best, but run to Jesus and let Him commune and dwell with us. I will follow the voice of the Lord over any other voice and choose to let that be the path we humbly walk on. I give into our differences and let them be a place where we find connection, learning, enjoying, and discovering new things about ourselves. I will let myself be affected with you and by you. I choose to live my life alongside of you, Cade. Not before you or behind you, but always beside you. I will never leave you. I will not prioritize an idealistic life above the real life we have together. I commit to never giving up on you and to falling in love with you the rest of my life. I will choose reality in our story without entertaining any idols this world could offer. You are my dream. You are God's dream for me, and I will savor all of you. I give you these words as a declaration of my love and my commitment to be yours from this day forward. I love you. I will never leave you. I will stay with you. I will love you always. Today The house shells and coins Swallowed all the darts I threw All to you I'd rather have you in my mind